the fuck I'm gonna fight for? Shed light on your block with this light pole. Dumb nigga, broke boy, pockets light pole. I'm gonna be doing a rant video basically of annoying things adults slash parents do. And I'm inside of this hot car because um I'm not driving nowhere. Because your girl need... I say. Oh, your girl only 15, so she needs a licensed adult right here. And I ain't got one right here, but my camera. So, therefore, we're just going to be sitting here chilling, maxing, relaxing, and ranting about these adults. All right. Um, well, I'm going to break a sweat. But the first thing is that adults do that I hate is, of course, oh, that was ghetto. The normal thing, basically, when every other kid hates this, when you're in your room chilling, and then they want to be like, Leilani! You say yes, but then nothing. So then they're going to call your name again. You say yes again. And they continuously call your name yelling and screaming while you answering them. And then basically what you got to do is get up from being comfortable, walk in there, and see what they want. And then that's not even a bad thing. They just say something dumb like, clean your room, or hand me the remote. Yeah. I'm upset. Fifty thousand on my head is dishes. Do this? They make me just wanna. I just wanna catch their hands or something. Uh. It don't make no sense. Ooh. Hold on, big fella. Your girl got hot for a second. Gonna fall out for a minute. Hold on. Oh, there's some hot air. Oh. Okay. Let me roll the window down. I ain't trying to suffocate. There we go. We Gucci. We in this thing. Oh, I'm burning my back. So for the next thing that adults do that I hate. Y'all, I might have to move places because it's hot. It's real life hot. Your girl ain't trying to catch no heat stroke. Pause. My camera getting hot. I'm getting so sweaty, so I need to hurry this up. But like when you get, when you got the scientific facts and you write about something. They're going to get mad. They're going to call you everything in the book. You being smart. You ungrateful. You all this and that. But you was just right about something and they was wrong. Adults hate being wrong. What? Like, serious right now? So I'm in trouble. I'm grounded because I was right. But no, to you, I was being smart. How does that work? Can someone explain, please? I hate when... Ooh. Okay, your G got extra hot and sweaty, as you were probably able to see in the other clip. But, another, we moved to the garage, basically. Cheese, girl, I'm just kidding. But, um, my camera's most likely about to die, so let me change the batteries real quick. Okay. Another one is when, oh, my son's coming When you ask your parents way ahead of time to do something, like, you be like, mom, about two months, or mom, <laughs> not too much really, but like, mom, next week is a party, can I go up to it? And they're just like, oh yeah, sure, of course, honey. And then, next week, you know, the day comes, you tell them you're going somewhere. Uh, where do you think you're going? Mom, you basically said I could go to this party. I asked you, like, I brought it up to you maybe like four times yesterday. But then they just want to make an excuse on why. You can't go. I mean, basically saying no when you already asked them. How does that work? Like, if you an adult and you watching this, how? Do, like, why do you change your mind for no reason? You say yes. Okay, now you're saying no, and I'm just. Okay. Um, another one is basically it's hot. But another one is basically when you ask your parents to do something for you. Like, can you take me down the street? I want to get something to eat. I want to get ice cream, something like that. And you have money, but they tell you no. But yet, they could sit here and ask for anything in the world. 
Leilani, come give me the remote. Leilani, come do this. Leilani, come wash my dishes. Leilani, come fold my covers. All this and that. But when I ask you to drive me down the street slash right around the corner slash or right around the corner, it's a no. You got gas. You got money for that. All that. But it's a no. I'm upset. 50,000 on my head is disrespect. That's the one I just said, basically. But, like, when your parents tell you, like, you ask them a question and they say no. And then not, not, not even that. You ask them why or how come. But, oh, now you're being smart. You're just being a smart little girl now or a smart little boy now. You're just a smart little kid. And then they don't give you an answer because I said so. Really, nigga? So, mom, you're saying, no, I can't go outside and smell the flowers because you said so. How does that work? I don't understand why they say that because I said so. So if you ask me to do the chores or do the dishes, I'm going to say no. And then I'm going to get beat because, okay, before I used to, like, never have my room clean. But now I keep my room clean. As I'm getting older, I know my room needs to be clean. So, basically, I used to think this every single time. My mom walked in my room. Oh, your room is so dirty. Clean your room. How is my filth bothering you? I don't get it. If my room is that dirty for you to say something, stay out of my room. I never really understood that. It's at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. And I still don't, to be honest. But I love my mom so much. Ain't none of this hate to be able to talking back, being smart. No, it's just basically what I think about it. I love my mom. Okay, this is the last one I'm going to say, even though there's plenty more. But when you say something and they over-exaggerate it. Like, you could sit here and say, all right, mom. But then she can be like, oh, she cussed at me and said, F you, mom, and all types of stuff like that. Well, I don't understand none of this. I, why over-exaggerate? Like, you being extra. I hate that so much. But like I said, parents gonna be parents. Even though I never said that, but parents gonna be parents. Like I have said, I love my mom to death. I love my mom so much. Just wasn't making a video trying to be smart or anything. It's just how I feel and just what I think, basically. But hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. All that good, good. You know, that's so ghetto. But, um, yeah. So, catch y'all later. I'm gonna go to Vegas tomorrow, so I'm probably gonna be recording there. Don't know what I'm gonna do, but yeah, thank you for watching and subscribe, of course. Bye.